Hello everyone, and we're back with more Jurassic World Evolution 2. And so I w got us back to the point that we were when we got the dillas. And like, you know, we don't have the dillas now, but we got two Krylov stores instead of one this time. So we have Gil and Joe. I'll introduce them in just a second. One yard of power is this empty. Yeah, why not? There we go, no power warnings or anything, because I don't want to start losing money again. But we have Gil and Joe. Also, we have Albert, who still has a wallet phone, as you guys probably know. Because he's Albert. If he didn't have a swallowed phone, it'd be weird. But alright guys, let's see what creature we should get this time, because... Obviously not these guys. Hmm. I want to get a rare source. I do. But I don't know if I have the power to contain them. You know what? We've, we've never seen Metric at the source. Let's get Metric at the source. Especially since Halo told me not to. So if I didn't do it, we wouldn't be saying true to ourselves. Now would we? Let me see. I need to rest on my staff as well. Because I'm slowly not built. Connect to scientist services. You must build the control center. So I guess my mouse is not like being connected. It just decides no. Alright, so we've got that. Okay. It's gonna be done in one minute. It's from Phoenix. Look at Phoenix. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this is horrible. Don't you love it when that happens? I really hate that though, that's ridiculous. Like, why can that even happen? So yeah, we're replacing the dillos. <laughs> Anyone that wanted to see more dillos? No. Just... That's never happening again. Don't care how much you want. I said no. Okay, three minutes. Nemesis found. Two of three. How dare you evade my capture? Boom. Boom. See, here's the thing. I don't know what they want, per se. So I'm not sure exactly what I'm gonna need. Alright, they're all good for the gate right there. Alright, Metric at the source requires status check. I think visiting Ranger Post 1. Can I take you to Ranger Post 3 instead? Because I feel like this place needs to be visited first. Alright, Metric at the source 2. Missing force, but you aren't lonely, so that's good. Check 
finished. Alright, so do you guys seriously just want forest or something? Because yeah, I can do that. You can just put a ton of forest everywhere. So you guys are fine. Let me see. Open space is fine and everything. You guys just need some prey in your territory. Which I can perfectly do. Boom. And they're happy. What's your star rating? 510. I swear if you go after that fence. Alright, good. You didn't go after the fence. Let's go ahead and save because compatible dinosaur, we need to save. That's all it is. Like if it weren't a compatible dinosaur, you know what we'd have to do. Same thing that we had to do with the dillos, remember? Either A, feed them to Albert and Gil and Joe. Or just B would be restart again. Hooray. No, that'd be horrible. Alright, now the metric and the source are always in view. Also, they're expanding their territory a lot. It's cool. Ooh, I showed security rating. Okay. Also, all the dinosaurs that we have on this island, they're all super happy right now. Which is actually just, That's amazing for us. Oh, by the way, I figured out, I figured out how the gil Dillos were getting out. I just said Gillos again. My gosh. But I figured out how the Dillos got out. So, small dinosaurs can climb the fences when they aren't electrified. Oh my gosh. The dogs need to be quiet. Dude. If you guys can't hear them, that's... If you guys can't hear them, that's good. But the dogs are deciding that they want to bark at nothing. But they won't be quiet. It's just the little one, too. And it, this is so annoying to deal with. Especially since I'm recording, and I know you guys don't want to listen to this. Let's get this fence done, though. Maybe we can get the Allosaurus from Big Rock. Is Big Rock a real place? I don't even know. I mean, it probably is. There's some doggies that need to be quiet. Yeah, my brother's yelling at them now. Like, one of the dogs, our older one, he stopped barking immediately when we told him to. The other one is like, I'm gonna keep barking forever. It sounds like that's what she's gonna do. So this enclosure isn't big enough, I'll just trank them and move them, but yeah. Wait a minute. I feel dumb now. As well, yeah, we're turning a profit, we're turning a big profit. Um, what are your likes? We can put them in here. We can actually put them in here. That's amazing. Also, these guys are like beyond comfortable. As you can see, like they have much more than they need. Live capture completed. That big, that big rock. Two of two. Ooh. Let's see, will you be happy in here because like, you know, you like them and they like you. So I don't know why you wouldn't be happy. Asset 
Like $27.99. Oh, oh, we got it. Shawl dinosaurs of 80% comfort. Been, if I'm not mistaken. And I'm not mistaken. We're on the cusp of achieving a new relationship with the dinosaurs. Forging revolutionary ideas because we're able to better understand the past. And boy, do we now. We're trying to put those accidents behind us. Well, if I may, um, there are no accidents. Simply undiscovered reasons. Our mistake, humanity's mistake, is believing that we want to know the truth when the lie is more than enough to sustain us. These genetically manufactured dinosaurs, they're as real as we chose to make them. We've manipulated and crossbred dogs and cats and livestock for years. Why? Not for what they need, but for what we want out of the animals. Oh, no. And you think that's what we're doing now? You tell me. Any contact, no matter how slight and reasoned, introduces change. Is that not correct? Dr. Dua, enlighten us. For now, it's what we have to accept. Our job, my job, is to make sure these animals have the best care. As for the rest, let come what may. Yes, yes, how wonderfully uh, uh, chaotic of you. Now, I may want to put some extra prey here, though. I mean, it makes sense, right? Because if there's this many creatures in one paddock. Also, I'm guessing these guys are still expanding territory, maybe. Which would be, would be some the islands, we never created something this... This... Perfect. Well, considering we can't let them run free, and the dinosaurs will never really know the life they should be living, it's as perfect as can be. I guess... We should be happy. But... are we... happy? Sorta? Okay, something's bothering you, and it's not me. No. So, what gives? This park. This isn't the dinosaur's final stop. Is it? No, of course it's not. How could it be? It's too dangerous to have these animals this close to civilization. They go, we go. You mean that, Owen? You realize what you're saying? We're a team. I know you, Claire. You won't turn your back on them. Which is a bad idea, by the way. Never, never do that. And, and neither can I. These animals are a destiny that we can't escape. Not just you and me, it's everyone. That's something the Earth needs to come to terms with. Yeah, we either make this planet right, or the dinosaurs. They'll make it theirs. Well, that was cool. Let's see, did we just complete it? Mission complete. California. Yeah, Yosemite. Huh. From the language of the Miwok Bye, tribe, Albert. It bye, Gil. Bye, Joe. The Valley of the Killers. Bye, Allo. There. Bye, Metric. Fitting, bye, the other guys that didn't name. The strong prey on the weak. The hunter and the hunted constantly optimizing their size, bye, Becky. their appearance, their strength, their vision, their and speed. Tape Vehicle under the threat. Becoming ever better at that one task necessary for survival. Huh. Evolution is a never-ending arms race that continues to this day. That's life. It embraces change. And now dinosaurs have returned to the Valley of the Killers. The question isn't, do they belong in Yosemite? They most certainly do. No, no, the question is, will they stay? That is the question. I think. Like, what am I loading to, or is it just sending me back a menu? Why not try out Chaos Theory Jurassic Park next? Help Dr. Hammond realize his dream of Jurassic Park while learning fundamentals of creating a safe and profitable dinosaur park for your guests.
Uh, do I click it? <laughs> do I click it? I don't know. Do I click it? I mean, I, I want to. You know what, guys? We'll do it, but not this video. Because this was the end of the campaign, and I'm not going to start this in the beginning of, like this. So, yeah. We will do this, though. I want to do this so badly. Well, if you enjoyed this, guys, leave a like, subscribe if you want to see more, and if you want to see the challenge mode. I mean, chaos theory, not challenge mode. Mm. But, yeah. That's about it for me. We beat it so easily when we got the Metrogranthosaurus, which Halo told us not to get. So, thanks, Halo. You lied to me. <laughs> eh. Well, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.